Welcome back to the channel, everybody. I am Florida Boy, and this is my EDC channel. Today, super, super excited about this video, so we are not going to waste any time. Microtech, standard issue. Let's get into it. So for all of you that are watching, that are trying to get your hands on one of these, you know what I'm talking about. This thing has been a pain to get a hold of. Um, I still, I still really, really would like to get my hands on a stitch. Um, but you know, I was thinking about it and uh, I kind of, I kind of think I want the auto stitch. I, I haven't had a stitch yet and uh, you know, why not start off where they were originally intended to go? So um, I have opened this box and I just did it to make sure that, you know, everything was in the box, right? like that it was everything was right. So I haven't really got to look at it or play with it a whole lot. So we are going to knock that out right now. Um, this is not going to be a, a review. This is just going to be a um, just an unboxing. And I know that's not the most fun thing in the world, but uh how, how do you review something if you haven't got a chance to use it? So here is the packaging. We already looked at it. And here is some of the goodies that come inside the box. And, oh, MSI, our Microtech sticker shooting out at me. Tells you about knife care, sharpening, storage, about the, the warranty. Tells you how to use it if you have not had one. Um, folder and auto. Just, just some literature on Microtech and the goodies. I do like the sticker though. Sticker's sweet. All right, all right. Enough, enough playing around. Just covering my steps. I am so ready to take this thing out, play with it, carry it. Um, I've been, man, I have been trying so hard to get my hands on one of these. Uh, so I actually did pick this up from the Microtech uh, gear website. And pretty much if you're expecting to buy one of these from Microtech, you have to be on their Instagram. They announced the launch of, or not the launch, but they announced the drop of these. And it was like, I think they announced it around like noon or one. And I didn't see it until like three o'clock. And for the launch, they were saying to be checking the Microtech gear website between four and five. So about 345, I was on the MSI page, this one. And uh, yeah, I was just hitting the refresh button. It is absurd. Luckily, I was on. It was my day off, so I was able to sit there and just while I'm watching TV, just hit refresh and look over every once in a while. And uh, then I noticed that the page for this, like, um, not for this, but the Microtech Gear page, like the order of the knives started changing, and I was like, oh, okay, so the drop's about to happen. So after like one or two more refreshes, um, it popped up, it was for sale and uh, yeah, ordered it, bought it and was ready to go. So super excited. You know, what's funny is um, I think my, my credit card info and stuff is saved on my computer. So I mean, realistically, once it said that I could buy one of these, I, I had it within like, I was checked out in like 10 seconds, if not less. Um, by the time I was done checking out, and it refreshed the page, they were already sold out. So it, it was crazy. This, I, I swear to you, this sold out in less than 30 seconds. It was, it was absurd. So here we go. Here is your Microtech standard issue or the MSI. And I am absolutely gonna carry this. Here we go. Um, my serial number is 659. And you can see his birth date is March, 2023. So this has the new RAM lock. Super, super stoked to check this out. Um, these run about two, 250 plus tax. Um, Microtech ships with UPS. So I think after everything was all said and done, I think I, I think I had a whole $265 into it, somewhere around that general vicinity. I, man, this these like Warncliffe style blades, I think these are just absolutely perfect for EDC. Um, it just 
great great utility cuts you could really get up there and you can do a little bit more precision cuts uh, man I, i'm super excited to check this out especially the new m390 mk uh, there's there's some write-ups online definitely go check that out if you are interested in knowing more about that uh, basically it's just m390 with better edge retention um, I know there's some, you know, don't, don't, don't send the, <laughs> don't, don't send the blade material police after me. It's, it, it is, there is some other composition differences between normal M390, but, uh, you know, that's to me, that's the main difference. So here is your Ram lock. There you go. See how that actuates. I, I am I am super excited to check this out. Um, oh, I've been wanting one for a while. <laughs> Man, I've been chasing this dragon for a minute. So um, I'm not gonna go into a bunch of crazy stuff. Now I do wish I would have gotten the carbon fiber, but uh, you know I think I think they're gonna release that. I think that's gonna be released later on. Um, maybe maybe not right up front or right right in the very beginning. Who? Who knows? So this thing, just feeling that, yeah, you can you can reverse flick it. You have to put a little bit of wrist into it. I think that I think that you know for the most part you're gonna slow roll this blade, or you are absolutely gonna just flutter it around with that ram lock. That that ram lock feels nice. Yeah, that feels great. Uh, it pretty much has lived up to all my expectations. Um, if you are trying to get your hands on one of these, keep an eye on my community page. I am 100% keeping an eye on them because like I said, I do want the stitch. Uh, so I'm pretty sure they said next Friday, um, they're going to be releasing some stitches on there. So I think next Friday is going to be the drop. Usually it's between four and five. So I will try to keep an eye on that. And I'll just let everybody know. The more I find out, the more I'm going to let everybody know. Uh, I want everybody to, you know, get their hands on one. Just, you know, fair is fair. But if anybody has a stitch and they want to sell it, please let me know. <laughs> so one thing I do like about this, um, I'm not too sure about this hardware. Yeah, this is, okay, that's stainless. Backspacer is titanium, stainless hardware. Yeah, stainless hardware, stainless clip. So does have titanium backspacer. Super, super, super excited about this. Oh man, uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to think of things to say just because you know, it's it's an unboxing. It's that's all this is. This is an unboxing. I told you it wasn't going to be a full review. I'm dying to do a full review of this. Um, I'm already like, I keep looking over at the stuff that I used to do reviews with. And, oh man. Let's just do the one test then. Let's just see. Yeah, that's... Yeah, see this thing. Ah, oh, you can just tell. Like, just holding this. I, I knew it was going to be everything I was hoping it was going to be. I just knew it. I'm so excited. <laughs> I know it's just a knife. It is. It is just a knife. But I have been trying to get my hands on the MSI. Now, like I said, I really, really want a stitch. But I also really, really wanted this MSI. So, super stoked. Um, real quick, one thing that we will do is we will just do a weight and a length uh so we'll go from tip to the end we are whew, that's a big knife uh looks just about nine inches from what i mean that's that is super close to nine it might just be shy of nine inches but it is very very close and then if we do a little bit of a weight let's see here oh if i can get that out there we go Got my hands on it. I kind of changed. I kind of changed stuff around here in the studio. 
end up having to get used to it. I got a new table, trying to see if maybe it wouldn't shake so much when I'm doing my recordings. So uh, yeah, I had to reposition everything. I'm still working on it. So this is 5.4 ounces. They have it listed at five ounces on the website. So it is a little bit heavier than what they say. Yeah, 5.4, which is okay. I don't mind a heavy knife. To be honest, I prefer it. Um, I'm definitely not a minimalist by any means, not a minimalist. So yeah, this has just been a quick look at the MSI and uh, yep, yeah, it lives up to all expectations. Everything I've heard about it so far seems 100% spot on. Um, G10 work is, I mean, it's, it's, it's Microtech, everything's gonna be perfect. Um, but the G10 work looks great. Uh, the RAM lock system is absolutely awesome. And this nice little RAM lock button right here in very, very traditional Microtech fashion is super tactical, <laughs> very, very aggressive jimping. Um, so the only thing I'm seeing that I don't like is I don't like this clip, not all that much. We've got this giant duck bill on the end and I don't know why we have a double you know double retention here um is what it is i guess i guess they just wanted this thing to be overly overly tactical uh but you know it, it has some decent retention on there i'm thinking the main thing about this was less retention on the front a little bit more on the back I, it feels that way a little bit it feels a little bit more rigid here on the back so i'm going to assume that means it's easier to get in the pocket harder to get out of the pocket but uh, uh, this this drives me crazy. That's gonna hook on the very first thing I walk past. I can just, I feel it in my bones. I can just feel it. Yeah, this is, if you don't have one of these, uh, man, I haven't even, I haven't even got the chance to carry it yet. Um, that'll be today. The action is buttery smooth. And I, you know, a lot of people are talking about lock stick. I'm, I'm not feeling it, at least not yet. Um, yeah, see, if you're gonna, if you're gonna do some reverse flicking with this, you got to put a little bit of wrist behind it. Ah, ah, nice. All right, I'm gonna wrap this one up because we are pushing like 15 minutes, and I just wanted to do a short unboxing. I'm gonna go ahead and carry this. I'm going to carry this for at least a few days and then we will we'll see how it turns out and um, we'll do an update video not an update video we'll do a full review so let me let me just give it some pocket time and then I'll figure out things I do and don't like about it and then uh, then we'll touch back on another video so expect that within the next few days and uh, yeah let's go ahead and wrap it up thank you guys so much for being here definitely definitely keep an eye out for one of these if you're in the market for the MSI um, and uh, I will continue to post on my community page about where and when you can pick those up as I hear about them. So if you guys like this video, please hit that like button and consider subscribing. Thank you so much for being here. I'll catch you on the next one.